For more than five decades, Dentsply Rin's XCP film holding system has represented the state of the art in dental radiography. However, as the dental industry transitions from traditional film to digital radiography, conventional film holding systems are changing to newer, more advanced designs, like the Dentsply Rin's XCP DS Fit Universal Digital Sensor Positioning System. And with digital sensors that are larger and more inflexible than film, positioning is more important than ever. Achieving accurate results is dependent on several key factors. One, the precise alignment of the film or the sensor to the X-ray beam using an appropriate positioner. Two, the ease of the practitioner in assembling and placing the positioner correctly in the mouth and three, the comfort of the patient during the radiographic procedure. This module will illustrate simple positioning techniques that will allow you to realize accurate, distortion-free radiographs each and every time. The XCP family of positioners is specifically designed for use with the extension cone paralleling technique, a radiography technique that offers several important advantages. First, the paralleling technique eliminates the need for you to determine the angulation and positioning of the X-ray tube head in relation to the film or sensor, taking all the guesswork out of positioning. Most importantly, the paralleling technique minimizes dimensional distortion and presents the objects being radiographed in their true anatomical relationship and size. This results in sharper, more accurate radiographs that enable dentists to diagnose and plan better treatments. Please note, during this training module, we will be demonstrating X-ray positioning techniques using a digital sensor and the XCP DS Fit Universal Autoclavable Digital Positioning System with a RIN XCP Aura 3-in-1 ring and arm. If you are using film, you can apply the same techniques using the XCP film positioning system. To position the XCP DS Fit digital positioning system for anterior maxillary teeth, assemble the anterior instrument and securely insert the digital sensor vertically into the blue bite block. The active area of the sensor should be placed against the flat surface of the backing plate. The XCP DS Fit is a universal sensor holding system with a self-adjusting retention clip that stretches to fit both your size 1 and 2 sensors. Center the sensor behind the teeth to be radiographed and position it in the center of the mouth. With the bite block placed on the incisal edges of the teeth to be radiographed, instruct the patient to close slowly and bite gently to retain the position of the sensor. Once the bite block is in place, slide the aiming ring down the indicator rod close to the skin surface. Align the tube head of the X-ray unit in close approximation to the aiming ring and center it. You are now ready to take the X-ray exposure. For anterior mandibular teeth, follow these same steps, centering the digital sensor behind the mandibular teeth to be imaged, positioning it as posterior as the anatomy will allow. Placing the sensor into the center of the mouth where there is more room to accommodate it will allow better alignment and more patient comfort. With a sensor, it is sometimes difficult to place the sensor parallel to the teeth due to its size and inflexible nature. For patient anatomy that doesn't allow parallel placement of the sensor to the teeth, allow the sensor to find its own spot in the mouth and allow it to be off parallel. To minimize elongation or foreshortening, adjust the vertical angulation of the X-ray tube head to keep it parallel to the sensor. Slight distortion may result from this, but in some cases it is the only option. To position the XCP DS Fit Digital Positioning System for posterior maxillary teeth, follow the same assembly steps using the yellow posterior bite block and ring alignment guides. Center the digital sensor behind the teeth to be radiographed using the entire length of the bite block so that the sensor is positioned along the midline. With the bite block placed on the occlusal surfaces of the teeth, 
instruct the patient to close slowly and bite gently. Position the XCP Aura aiming ring as previously described and align the tube head. For posterior mandibular teeth, center the digital sensor behind the second molar. The lingual position of the sensor should be as medial as the tongue attachment will allow so that the anterior border of the sensor aligns with the distal portion of the second premolar. When the patient bites, allow the sensor to find its own place in the mouth, guiding the positioner into place and again adjusting the vertical angulation if required. Due to the sheer size of sensors and their inability to flex, it is imperative to place the sensor in the center of the mouth. Patient acceptance and comfort will be far greater by following this rule. To position the XCP DS Fit Digital Positioning System for bite wing x-rays, assemble the bite wing instrument as shown. For bicuspids, align the anterior border of the digital sensor with the distal portion of the mandibular cuspid. For molars, align the anterior border of the digital sensor with the distal portion of the second premolar. The bite block should be positioned in the mid-palatal area for maximum patient comfort and should rest on the same side of the arch as the teeth being radiographed. The most common problem with bite wing x-rays is overlapping the interproximal contacts. To open the contacts and properly position a bite wing exposure, the x-ray beam must be parallel to the interproximal spaces and not to the teeth being radiographed. If the x-ray beam is parallel to the spaces and perpendicular to the sensor, a perfect bite wing will be achieved. If the x-ray beam is not parallel to the spaces, overlapping will occur, resulting in retakes and the potential of misdiagnostic information. For distortion-free radiographic images, it is recommended that the paralleling technique be used with the XCPDS Fit Digital Positioning System. However, if you prefer the bisecting technique, or are unable to achieve the paralleling technique due to the inflexibility of the digital sensor or anatomy of the patient, Densply Rin offers the Snap Array DS and Easy Grip Digital Sensor Holders specifically designed for the bisecting angle technique. For either an anterior or posterior bisecting angle radiograph, assemble the sensor properly in the instrument and position it in the mouth with the sensor placed as close to the teeth being radiographed as possible. Then, with the patient biting gently, direct the central ray of the x-ray tube head at a right angle to the imaginary plane that bisects the angle formed by the sensor and the central axis of the teeth being radiographed. High quality radiographs depend upon accurate positioning and effective positioning systems. Whether it's film or sensor positioning, you'll get the best results possible by following these simple guidelines and using the long-standing Densply Rin positioning systems.